15 Porsches that we wish would make a comeback. Number 15 Porsche Panamera Manual Transmission There's no shortage of great Porsches, but some were greater than others, and we want them back. Very few automotive manufacturers have the level of consistency and success experienced by Porsche. Thank you for subscribe. Number 14 Porsche 914 6. After all, Porsche pioneered the rear engine vehicle setup while also perfecting the trademark small block flat 6. Although Porsches are, more or less, the same over these decades, they've still had some unique classic models. Number 13 Porsche Boxster R60 Spider. Today, Porsche's lineup consists of an SUV, sports cars, hybrids, and so on, very well established for the current market. Of course, there could always be some extra diversity injected into the registry, particularly in the form of some discontinued classics. Purists slash enthusiasts would go mad with anticipation and sales could skyrocket. Number 12 Porsche 924 First off, we've got a very self-explanatory Porsche model. Just as you'd probably think, the goal here is for a manual, 6-speed, transmission, but in the newer Panamera models. Number 11 Porsche Type 64 once upon a time, the first generation Panamera had a manual option, however, it was limited and quickly phased out. A sports car that needs some love and deserves another opportunity is Porsche's 914. Push like. Number 10 Porsche 959. Perhaps the most neglected slash omitted Porsche ever. More specifically, though, the faster 914-6 model, the small sports car which wasn't a bug standard 911. Number 9 Porsche 356 Speedster With a push towards smaller, more ecologically friendly, vehicles, we believe that the 914, 914-6, could be the ideal platform. Number 8 Porsche 944 Compared to a lot of the old Porsches, the 928 was a not looking one. Nicknamed the Egg by a handful of fans, the 928 wasn't Porsche's most reliable sports car. Number 7 Porsche 956 Yet, it sold well and won over a decent portion of the buying public. It's unlikely that the 928 name will return, but perhaps a reference to the egg styling. Number 6 Porsche 928 Before you start, we're aware that the 911 RS bar is in use today, just not as a road car. Rather, a GT class race car for the track only. Since the platform is already Number 5 Porsche 911 Carrera RSR 3.0 There, it'd be easy for Porsche to swap in a new RSR 3.0 liter flat 6, mimicking the classic, regulate it for the road, and sell it to the general population. Easier said than done, though. Number 4 Porsche 550 Spider few Porsche purists may argue that the Carrera GT already has a remake, the Porsche 918 Spider. Yes, it's newer, but not a recreation, rather, it's successor. Don't get us wrong. Number 3 Porsche GT1 Stress Inversion The 918 is outstanding, however, it's no Carrera GT. Number 2 Porsche 917 The Carrera GT is a whole other level than today's supercars. 
Number 1 Porsche Carrera GT Powered by a ludicrous V10 and a wild nature, the GT was certainly a race car that managed to sneak past the regulations, at least it feels that way. It was so crazy, in fact, that Porsche released several statements about the Carrera GT's difficulty to operate, one day before Paul Walker's infamous crash. Thank you for watching.